All right, guys, welcome back to our playthrough of Jurassic Park Trespasser. We've come a long way, so let's continue going up this mountain. Only a lot of raptors take up territory right here, which is pretty interesting. Um, the debacle of August 27th, 1989 is now quite well known. And the legal consequences were, as you may well imagine, uh, rather extensive. The debacle of 1989. Yeah, they're going with it, man. They, they want you to think that Jurassic Park did indeed take place in 89. About 20. Now, what's, what's really interesting, and I think a lot of people will agree with me... Looks like 20. ...is the fact that... About 20. Jurassic Park Trespasser Hasn't been used. uses a lot of great lines from Richard Attenborough that I think should be used in future material as some sort of canon thing because obviously the actor is no longer with us. Yet he is kind of preserved, that character is preserved through this game's work. Unfortunately, this game is pretty far from being canon. What? Am I... Okay, I can't jump. What's down there? That will kill me. Save time. All right, all over the place. We've been saving a lot lately, so we're going to go ahead and do it again. Um, we've been using some quotes during the San Diego portion. Everybody off the boat. Oh, so close. Okay, what about Skipper SS Venture? No, that won't work. Um, you got your trophy. Fuck only. But it's a lie. Everybody's going to line up and appreciate it and everything it does. What's the matter? He didn't make it. RJ. I'm gonna die right here. I'm so sorry. Oh, you heard, like, the blood splat right there. Oh, man. Okay, uh... Obviously, if I throw my gun on it, or... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where's my gun? This thing's turning. Feels full. It's like Super Mario, uh, 64. <laughs> Don't fall. Oh, I made it! What the hell kind of puzzle is this? I, can, I must have done that... Oh, it stopped. Maybe that's not how you're supposed to do it, or... Maybe that is? I don't understand. What is this? Is this... Like, what, what purpose does this serve? You know what I mean? Like, why was this created? What is that railroad spike thing doing right there? I don't know. Just move on. You didn't die. Continue up the hill. Very interested to see what else is here. On October the 3rd, 1989, I sat on a wooden bench in the waiting room in Washington, D.C. A golden panel put me on the stand. As my name was read out, the session room went silent. I walked up the aisle towards the stand. I was being called to account, but I had no clear explanation to give. Wow. Again, need I even, like, mention how great that would be if Six that was in a movie? Left. Hammond had to go to Washington, D.C. after the events that happened in Jurassic Park. But then you got a question like, I wonder how they found out, apart from, obviously, Ian Malcolm didn't exactly follow protocol on what he was supposed to do. I gave myself over to the strange, family <laughs> discipline of the market. Investment strategies and profit. Wow, and I died. Wow, okay. And I didn't save. Wow, this is, this is excellent, excellent. On 
was able to do that again, only this thing didn't start turning. Can I do this? I, I, I have no idea what, what that even... What is that? Cool thing is, we're going to get to hear John Hammond speak again. But should really save, just in case. That sounds like a... Or that looks like a dangerous puzzle, you know what I mean? Uh, another quote from The Lost World Jurassic Park. I already used, thank God, for Site B on my first mess up at the beginning when I was trying to play around with this game, so can't use that. Um, but we can use Isla Nobla was just, oh, no. <laughs> By God, they're flourishing. <laughs> Your lucky pack. <laughs> oh, uh oh. Almost forgot the why. Oh my god, it still worked. Okay. Oh, that's just my lucky pack. On October the 3rd. 1989, I sat on a wooden bench in the waiting room in Washington, D.C. A government panel put me on the stand. As my name was read out, the session room went silent. They walked up the aisle towards the stand. I was being called to account, but I had no clear explanation to give. God, that's some fascinating stuff. I gave myself over to the strange, lonely discipline of the market, investment strategies and profit. I stood apart, master of codes and lost worlds of heat and cold and the sleep of a hundred million years. Master of code and lost worlds of heat and cold and the sleep of a hundred million years. Wow. I better save the ammo. Not only is there boxes like and crates and cars up here, there's a trailer. Back up, man. Keep going. Excuse yourself for my life. That's right. Oh, a drum mag. Okay, now. Can I get in here? Oh, no. What does it say? Construction personnel only. I'll bet. All right. Hasn't been used. Excellent. So. Looks like Hammond. Like. After he lost all the money in Jurassic Park, he went back into the stock market. Oh my god, that thing just... <gasps> no! Oh. Where did we save? Where did the vehicle stop? <laughs> oh god. I guess I'm not saving enough. On October the 3rd, 1989, I sat on a wooden bench in the waiting room in Washington, D.C. A government panel put me on the stand. As my name was read out, the session room went silent. They walked up the aisle towards the stand. I was being called to account, but I had no clear explanation to give. Saving right here too. Your lucky pack. Um, hang on to something. We already tried that, I believe. How about straight into the woods? Oh. Mm. Heads up. <laughs> I gave myself over to the strange of the market. Investment strategies and profit. I should park. 
master of codes and lost worlds of heat and cold and the sleep of a hundred million years. Okay. Now, what went wrong last time? Feels full. All right. About 15. What went wrong? Drop my gun. Not me gun. Fifteen or so. Fifteen or so. Oh, jeez, that scared me. Okay. Oh, jeez. This is dangerous. Oh, we... Okay. Some like cinder blocks? That's unrealistically, like, really dangerous. My work. My work lies where I left it. If there was anyone brave enough and clever enough to take it and return the keys to time, perhaps the foundation of a new empire. I feel really bad for poor old Hammond. All right, so eight left. Uh, am I getting it to work? I hear it, like. How do we get it down here? Interesting. Well, we can't climb up there. Uh, hold on. Maybe if I, like... Eight shots. That didn't do anything. Six. Whoa! Five. Well, I hit it. Maybe, uh... That thing's supposed to fall on it? Three. I have absolutely no clue how I'm supposed to get this to work. I can't tell if I'm moving or not. Oh, whoa, I'm getting it to come down. You have to keep your hand on it. Okay. Oh. But now I can't go up. Hold on a minute. Maybe... Three left. Okay, I think I did something completely wrong. Feels full. I don't want to get rid of that. Three left. 
I think what I'm supposed to do is... Whoa, okay. Yeah, I think what I'm supposed to do is actually, like, jump on this after I bring it down and then shoot the board and have it, like, hit this thing, which will send me up or something. Let's try that. Oh, jeez. I gave myself over to the strange, lonely design of the market. Investment strategies and plans. I stood apart. Master of codes and lost worlds of heat and cold. And the sleep of a hundred million years. Feels full. I thought that I was saving too much, but uh, this game... Let me tell you. About 20. Uh, I'm not worried about losing any weapons at the moment, except for that drum. Oh, jeez. Go! Oh, didn't fall this time. Okay, so... My work... My work lies where I left it. If there was anyone brave enough and clever enough to take it and return the keys to time, perhaps the foundation of a new empire. Okay. So far, so good. Left. That's that's actually pretty cool. I I enjoy that. This this feels very unsafe though. All right. Oh oh boy. Okay. And it would appear that. Oh boy. All right, guys. I am probably going to save right here, and this will probably be the final part, or one of the final parts. Go ahead and get rid of all that. Uh, what would be a good save file name? Heads up. Um, all right. Cancel that order. This is it, guys. If we're on level eight, this is this is the big one. All right. I'll see you all later. Yep, we have officially come across the final level for Jurassic Park Trespasser. After we finish this next episode, that will be all that exists within the final retail version of the video game. That's not to say that I intend to leave Trespasser alone and never explore it again, though because there are actually some available levels that got cut out of the game before its 1998 release that you can play online in some way, shape, or form via the internet. I just have to figure out how. Now aside from eventually doing all of that, I have to comment on this last chapter in level 7, and honestly, I gotta say that I kinda liked it. The puzzle at the end is tricky, but still pretty cool. And the narration by Richard Attenborough is of course amazing as always. I do really think it would be a good idea for somebody to just quote, fix every line of dialogue he says that refers to the incident of Jurassic Park taking place in 1989. If they want to canonize this material somehow, just go into the audio track where you'd eventually drop this stuff in, whether it be a movie or a new game or some sort of viral marketing campaign stuff, and just quickly add a 93 instead of a 89 like what he says there. It's a simple fix that I think people could get away with pretty easily. Now that we've climbed the mountain on Isla Sorna, we've got a group of vicious yellow jacket raptors to face. From here on out, we're going to be fighting to get off of Site B, and this should be extremely interesting. Now before I go, I want to thank all of my game wardens, as well as all of my engine executives like Bobby James, 
I'd also like to thank all of my park workers and engine hunters as well. Wild Stoner, words can't really express how awesome it is to have you guys tell me how much you enjoy the stuff I do, and I seriously am extremely thankful for everything that you guys do to help. Honestly, it means the world. Now I'd like to thank you all for watching this video, and I hope that you all enjoyed today's content. If you feel like I deserve it, I'd appreciate the like and hope that you'll consider subscribing if you're interested in hearing from me again. I'll see you all in the next video, guys, and as always, take it easy.